State University sophomore is in the hospital with two black eyes and a broken nose after his parents say a group of men assaulted him. KCCI's Vanessa Peng has a story from Ames, and it's new at 5. It was on this sidewalk in Welch Avenue in the 400 block behind me here where 20-year-old Kale Trollson's parents say he was brutally attacked and now they want the public's help. It was terrifying. Jennifer Trollson and her husband Bob rushed to the hospital, worried their son Kale might be minutes away from death. The pain that he's in is forever. At 6'9", 230 pounds, the Trollsons never expected Kale would be a victim of a brutal attack. They had kicked a hole in his small intestine. The Trollsons say last weekend on Sunday, Kale was leaving a friend's apartment at 425 Welch Avenue. It was just before 2 in the morning. There were men on the street and they had said something to a girl and he had stepped in. The Trollsons say Kale told the men he wasn't going to fight and went to shake someone's hand. That's when someone else came up from behind and punched him. Suddenly, Trulson tells us nine guys were attacking her son. And a witness has told us that he had one person on one arm, one person on the other arm holding him down. One guy was kicking him and one guy was punching him. The Trollsons say the men who did this to their son are not students, but older white males in their late 20s to early 40s. Now they're hoping someone saw something, anything, they can tell Ames police about. I personally think they just need one little piece of information, just one bit that gets them to the next step. Ames police say the investigation is ongoing. If you have any information, please call Ames police or send a tip anonymously by calling the Story County Crime Stoppers. In Ames, Vanessa Pang, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.